Pacino out here. Philly's Powered 89, of course. Los Angeles is where we are. BET Awards 2019. It is going down on Sunday and sitting with me. I got a Philly native, man. Yes, yes, yes. yes I yes, got yes. Mr. Pink Sweats hanging out today. What's going yeah, on? Yeah, what's up, Philly? Oh, my God. You got the song Honestly. Honesty, yeah, yeah. Everybody, yo, literally, everybody says honestly. I, I made a mistake. I should have named it honestly. Like, I'm not even joking. It's not even just you, and I don't even get upset because it's like, well, I fucked up. I should have just, I, I made a big mistake. It's all good. We still like it. We still singing to it and all that. First of all, you got to tell me. Because when I, when I heard the name Pink Sweats, I'm like, damn, he got to be rocking pink like all the time. And right now, you have this mauve outfit with some pink flowers. You got your pink headband. Tell me, how did you come up with the name Pink Sweats and why'd you do it? Uh, the universe came up with that name. Okay. I was just wearing pink sweats. Like, <laughs> I was a songwriter and um, just not caring about what I had on. I was just wearing these same pink sweats, like, all the time. <laughs> and then somebody was like, yo, where's pink sweats? And then I heard about it. And I was like, damn, that's actually a fire name. And it just stuck. Yeah, when I became an artist, I ended up taking that name and using it. So, so let me ask you, because, like I said, you are a writer, songwriter as well. I feel like sometimes it can be a little hard for songwriters to write for others and then venture out on their own to do their own thing. Did you find it hard for yourself? Nah, I, I, I literally write every single genre. Mm -hmm. And I spent a lot of years trying to do it well. Mm -hmm. So now I just mesh everything. And then a lot of people do the same thing. Like, yeah. not even, not a shade, but... It's a it's a game that you play, obviously, when you're on the artist side. People they want to follow the trend and mm -hmm. like do these things. So for me, it was easy. It was like just don't do what they're doing. <laughs> Be the opposite of what they're Literally. doing. Set your yeah. own trend and have people following you. Exactly. So as far as everything else that you have going on, tell us more. Like I said, songwriter. Now you're an artist. You got your single out. What else is going on for Pink Sweats, man? Uh, life is good. You know, um, I'm working on my album. I'm producing it. It's all live. I'm collaborating with uh, John Hill and my boy Michael Keenan. Okay. And uh, it's going to be epic. So when you say album, are we talking about EP or are we talking about LP? What are we no, talking like about here? No, like a full album, yes, LP. You know yes. what I'm saying? Yes, like, What kind of vibe can we get from that? Because when we hear your single, it's like you give us this nice, chill, soul sound. <laughs> so what kind of vibe are we setting the tone for with the album? Uh, I feel like the album is going to shock a lot of people. Mm -hmm. And um, for my mission and my goal is to just, you know, it doesn't matter where you come from. Music is music. And mm -hmm. um people just love music so i want to i want to deliver all facets of myself okay. through the music it's like all right i don't only listen to r&b i don't only listen to uh rap i don't only listen to country i listen right. to a bunch of stuff so i want to be able to match all that bring it to an album in sections where mm -hmm. people can say yo damn i don't even know one person could do all this <laughs> that well and then like make me like it so let me ask you also, with your album, I feel like a lot of Philly artists always tie in some form of Philly on the album. Can we expect that from you as well? Not on this album, okay. except maybe musically you'll hear the influences, but uh -huh. as far as the title, I'll leak it real quick because it's family. It's called Pink Planet. Hey, but, um, I was going to ask that. We got the yeah, exclusive. Yeah, yes. Literally, no, nobody, I don't even think my label know that yet. So don't shout to nobody else, okay? <laughs> right. <laughs> Pink Planet. Uh, it's, it's, the album really is just taking people outside of what they expect mm -hmm. it's just like yo come to a world where anything is possible and that's the imagination and the uh, mind of pink sweats so being out here at the BT awards 2019 what are you expecting or what are you looking forward to on sunday with the big show honestly i'm i want to see mary i heard my aunt is a big mary j Blige fan yes and i kind of want to live through that mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. see mary and then i could tell him like yeah i met mary j Blige. <laughs> i saw she was killing it and possibly work with her. Oh, that'd be dope. Hey, see, yeah. we, we got to set it up. We yeah, got to set it up. Yeah, got to call her. Tell yeah. her what's up. Well, I ain't got a number like that. Though. I just figured <laughs> you would have her number before I would, though. I don't. I wish. We're we going to find a way to get you that information <laughs> so you can possibly work with her, all right? Hit me up, man. <laughs> That's right, man. Pink oh, Sweats. Yeah, we, oh, we got these cupcakes, too. He about to dig in right now, too. Shout out to Southern Girl Desserts right out here in L.A. We are doing it big. BET Awards, the radio broadcast center. It is Philly's Power 99.